Wow. That's a pretty good ring. Well, it looks like it's time for a scuff magic find build. Especially the currency will definitely need because I have to buy some expensive items for this video. Sometimes lucky. So I strongly recommend you don't skip the fractured items. It seems like a waste of time, but in fact you'll find a lot of interesting things and it's a pretty good way to get a few extra divine orbs. It's mage blood, for sure. Thanks Chris. That's exactly what I wanted. Greetings exiles. And I continue my series from zero to hero with spectral shield throw deadeye and we're slowly getting to the final of this series. It's time to change our gems. Phantasmal Spectral Shield Throw is the perfect gem for us, which gives us a lot of Critical Strike Multiplier. Anomalous Inspiration for more Critical Strike Chance. Awakened Elemental Damage with Attacks, just because it's a little bit better than normal. And Awakened Vicious Projectile Support. We also need an Awakened Fork. Ouch. I don't think I'll be buying this gem yet. Enlightened support is not a must, but with it we can add precision, which is additional damage. Besides, it's not that expensive compared to our other purchases. I also forgot to mention in my last video that I replaced Herald of Ice with Herald of Purity because it gives us more damage. I also decided to add Diamond Flask to the build because it gives a nice damage boost, especially when combined with Phantasmal Spectral Shield Throw. This will be a temporary solution until I can increase the critical strike chance in other ways. Though I'll probably keep it in my final variant if I can't increase my crit chance for a reasonable price. Wow, those are some pretty expensive flasks. Let's try crafting it ourselves. That's not bad. But I think we can do something better. Nice. Not perfect, but I think this flask will work for now. Maybe we should make another flask. Not bad at all. Easy money. I'd also want to upgrade my heat shiver and add a useful enchantment. Wow, that's pretty expensive, so I guess I'll buy it later. Well, I upgraded my character a bit and our damage more than doubled, and now it's almost 5 million. And for true POB warriors, it will be even more. As you can see yourself, Spectral Shield Throw Deadeye can easily handle any non-Uber content in the game, and it does it very fast. And even though I spent a relatively large amount of currency on improvements for this build today, it was an unnecessary expense. And even with a minimum budget, this build feels just fine. Most likely the next video will be the last and I will show my end game variant of this build. So if you do not want to miss it, do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to like it. Bye everyone and see you in new videos.